tell me what the Valentine's. Remember, I pointed it out at Target. I don't know what it is. The coffee mugs. Coffee mugs? Yeah. Did you just say see camera over everything sweatshirt coming out this Friday, February 9th, 2018. What's going on guys? So today I was driving into work and last night I watched the movie called Lucy. I don't know if you guys ever saw it, but it was about like unlocking your mind and being able to do different things and it was like kind of a cool movie with Scarlett Johansson. It is estimated that most human beings only use 10% of the brain's capacity. Imagine if we could access 100% interesting things begin to happen. So anyway, it left me in a trance and I went to bed. I started thinking, I'm like, man, what if that could be true? Like, not necessarily like special powers, but what if you could unlock your mind where you had complete control on your thoughts, your emotions, everything in between. So I woke up real like in a weird mood slash like, I was like, oh my God, man, what? Like I was just in a, a real, real dazed mood and I was driving in and I'm like, like what makes us human and all this stuff. I was like real, real deep in thoughts and I, I'm shifting with my right hand. As soon as I went to, oh my my right eye itch. And I was like, man, where's my right eye itch? Like, you know what I mean? And all of a sudden I went to go scratch it with my, cause I was shifting with my right. I went to scratch with my left hand. And as soon as I moved my hand out of the way. It's a, lie! a deer jumped out literally out of nowhere. I didn't even see it. And I just completely like spot on, boom, shockers. And I just like, everyone asked me like, did you, did you stop? Was it the alright? I was like, I don't know, I kept driving. But sorry about your car, man. I kept driving and then I went to Wawa to get uh, my energy drink in the morning. And um, I was like, man, I hope this is not bad. But I did see like plastic slash glass come up. Luckily he didn't roll up on my hood because of my solstice is kind of low, like stock low. Um, he just kind of flew off and kind of did some flips. Got it to Wawa, checked out the damage. And like, best case scenario, I honestly only pushed in my bumper and smashed my headlight. So, the he was jumping across. I think his hip caught my headlight and then just went boom and then like off the car, I guess. But if you can see like, there's no gap there, there's a gap over there. So my bump, I think it's my actual, my bumper. Luckily this hood is a one piece hood. So realistically, um, it held together pretty good. Like no dents, no issues, just the headlight. Those headlights are kind of expensive. I was looking online and they're like a hundred bucks or no, 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 it's like 200, 250. And I was like, oh my God. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with that cause I have to get it inspected. So I have to fix that before I get it inspected. But yeah, it was kind of, it was my first time ever hitting a deer. I was really, it got me at it. Like I took all the hair, there was hair everywhere, but I took all the hair off and got everything, you know, cleaned up. I need to wash it, but that's size point. It just, um, it was scary. Cause I always asked my friends, I'm like, cause my friend just hit a deer. And I was like, what was it like? Cause I always see deer and I always stop and like, I can't imagine hitting them. And he was like, it just literally comes out of nowhere. And now I literally understand that you cannot prevent it. Like if the deer's, if you're gonna hit a deer and you hit one, it's not, like I wasn't on my phone, I wasn't doing anything. I was just scratching my eye and then out of the blue, like I wasn't scratching my eye for 15 seconds. Like it was literally three seconds, boom, deer, slow motion, glass, slash plastic, slash plexiglass. And uh, yeah, I was like, what the heck? But Solstice is all right. And I actually love driving it. It's actually my jam, really, really digging it. Yeah, that's my that's my story. I, I just, uh, I, I don't know, I, I was, 
It took me for surprise. My brother's coming into the town, and we're going to the Super Bowl parade in Philadelphia. If you guys are down there and live in Philly, come freaking holla at me. I'm gonna be at the museum. I know it's gonna be like a th of two million people, but I'm definitely gonna go there, and definitely just gonna hang out with the fam squad. My brother's coming up from North Carolina. My step pops is going. My mom's going. It's gonna be a fun time with the family. I'm excited. In preparation of that, it takes a day away from being able to do my for my preparation for the release for the seat time over everything hoodies so I have to really get to work so this short this video might be a lot shorter than usual just because I have a lot of work to do in preparation for this Friday and get everything ready I do a lot of product shoots I make sure everything on the website's good I'm like double check like shipping everything there's like there's a lot of behind the scenes work I do especially when it comes to releasing new products so and then also prepping that we did a photo shoot over the last week prepping all those pictures and editing every individual photo I always like to take my time with all the edits and really get down with Photoshop and like really manipulate the photo to make it look like a really good quality photo so I have to do all that work so I just I don't know what tonight's gonna hold um, I'd like to work a little bit on the solstice but honestly or one of the cards I just don't know if I have time to because um, I have a lot of preparation work I gotta do and especially tomorrow tomorrow my brother comes into town and I have to help him or he's gonna come over and we're gonna hang out family time all that good stuff so I don't know how much work I'm gonna get done tonight thanks for everyone that's been supporting me um, with the last couple of videos a lot of you guys just telling me to do a Honda build and I promise I will but these guys just take up all my time oh big news um, the body kit will be on its way for I think this Thursday or s Friday and by goodly golly it looks amazing I'm so excited I put a poll on Instagram and it's almost dead 50 50 the whole entire way like literally 50 50 and my question was do I do crazy library or do I go simple OG triple O no no mm -mm. Mm -mm. no 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 I want to know in the comments let me know in the comments what you want to see on this car the red car um, we have a lot of surprises coming for this car but I do want to know what do you like better do you like the simple clean look or do you like the crazy library I was gonna go crazy library with like chrome vinyl chrome this like bing bang boom a lot of different colors I don't know what you're talking about Hal. do it um, the hood will probably stay the same because the only way I'm gonna get rid of that is if I get a new hood but let me know in the comments. Let me know what you think. Let me know your thoughts. I want to know so we can get some rollies on. I'm just kidding. I don't know what rollies are. But yeah, I just need to get oil. I need to go to the. I need to go to Pep Boys. Get oil. Put oil in this. Um, finally paint my floor one day. Yeah. I've been slacking on this car, but she, she'll get love. I promise. She'll get love. I will definitely. Um, de it's gonna be different because like my new body kit has a front a rear bumper different side skirts different front bumper and um i'm doing a little special something um this year so you'll definitely see that i'm excited it's gonna look cool it should look cool that girl i don't know what to do with it i'm kind of at a loss where i don't i don't know my motivation for it just kind of dwindled when the trans is having issues and the clutch i swear this clutch isn't doesn't have enough pressure. Yeah, it doesn't have enough pressure at all. My master cylinder. Uh, yeah, it's not. There's no way. There's no way. So, little by little, the coupe will come together. I'm not really honestly worried about it at all. I just wanted to give you guys an overall update, but I think I'm just going to make a quick video, guys. I hope you guys understand I have a lot of work to do, a lot of family stuff to prepare, and um, it's been a crazy day. A lot of busy, busy work, busy, busy life, and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this short little update i promise i'll be back to my normally scheduled video next week i'm actually pumped up because the next video on friday will be from this thursday this thursday like i said we're going to the eagles parade in philadelphia and it should be a lot of fun i'm excited i'm excited to be there with my brother and be there with my family i know they're gonna enjoy it so um with that i'm gonna start getting to work if i can film a little bit later i will absolutely but 
until then holla at your boy guys we love you so much happy freaking wednesday thank you for supporting me whether it's a short video long video in depth video funny video everything in between we love you so much holla at your boy ah! what was that box for um it's for valentine's yeah here's your valentine um ooh, ooh. you're supposed to say me mm, um what? Um, this is for Miss Pat and this is for Miss Hannah. I know, but who's your Valentine? My Valentine's? Yeah. Oh. Mm. Everybody. Okay. But, but, my Valentine's? My Valentine's <laughs> is Daddy, my family, and all my friends at school. Oh, you're so nice, Lena. You're so nice. You know who gets hug? Daddy! <sighs> Thank you, Lena. Can I kiss? Oh, you're so nice. What did you say? Who's your Valentine? Me? Yes. <laughs> How do you feel? Now we've been living here for a year. Mm -hmm. I feel good. I think we've made a lot of progress. In life? Well, yeah, because next, our next step is... Cage the S13? Nothing's ever made me cry as much as you, I swear Your smile gives me motivation and some new ideas My worst fear is always you not knowing who I am Cause I've been on the road dream chasing for you out here I was the first thing that you opened your eyes to and the last one that you said goodnight to, I went home and cried to And I bawled my eyes out and then watched you, glad I got you That's a blatant fact And every negative thing I said, I swear I'll take it back